Hi, I'm Dr. Scott Hahn, and today we're going to talk about myopia management and myopia control. Um, this year, the FDA has approved a contact lens technology that helps slow down nearsightedness by about 50%. Uh, the importance of that is, well, for the first time, we have something that we can do about the uh, myopia, uh, what they're calling uh, epidemic. And that's because more and more people are becoming nearsighted. So by 2050, they're predicting that 50%, half the world, will be nearsighted. Along with nearsightedness comes lots of other problems. So not just that you know you have trouble seeing far away in the distances, but the more nearsighted you become, the more likelihood you could develop retinal problems, like retinal tears and retinal detachments. The more nearsightedness uh, you have, the more chance of having uh, premature cataracts or development of glaucoma. So the more that we can do to help slow down nearsightedness and myopia, uh, the better the, the actual long-term health of the, of the eye. Uh, these contact lenses work by changing peripheral light and peripheral uh, focus onto the retina. So the retina is the internal lining of the eye, and the stimulus for the growth of the eye occurs in that peripheral retina. So if we can change that stimulus so the eye is not growing too long and becoming too elongated, which is what's creating the, a lot of the nearsightedness, then we can help to slow down the myopia uh, progression. Uh, there are other things that are used to uh, help slow down myopia other than just contact lenses. You know, there are studies that show that uh, time spent outdoors can have an impact. Uh, of course, now with all the virtual learning and all the digital devices, uh, all this near vision accommodation uh, also affects nearsightedness. So things that we can do uh, to limit those activities and to help um, slow nearsightedness is going to help the, the actual health of the eye. I'm uh, very excited because it affects me personally, my family personally. Uh, just earlier this year, um, my daughter uh, had one of her regular eye exams and I noticed that she was starting to become nearsighted. And um, the nearsightedness was, was you know, a, a very mild amount. And then uh, as we were getting her glasses and she was wearing just normal regular contact lenses, uh, she started to complain that the glasses and the contacts were still blurry for her. And so we brought her back and, and we checked her. And in just a short period of time, in a matter of months, her nearsightedness had uh, changed really exponentially. And so that really made me, uh, well, sort of nervous as, as to what is her long-term trajectory and, and um, where is her nearsightedness going to stop and stabilize. And so when we had the, these FDA-approved contact lenses, I said, well, this is you know perfect for her and she will actually be my first patient to use these myopia control contact lenses in, in an attempt to slow down her nearsightedness so that she could have better long-term eye health. And um, not only for eye health and not only for helping people see better, but even if we planned, even if she plans as an adult that she was going to have some type of laser vision correction or some type of surgery to help her nearsightedness, patients who have smaller amounts of nearsightedness do much better compared to patients who have large amounts of nearsightedness that need to be corrected. So controlling myopia, myopia is good even if we plan to have surgery later on. So starting myopia control, um, starting it young obviously works better compared to starting it later. Uh, the FDA approved age is between age 8 and 12 in order to start the, the treatments and then you will continue the treatments until your eyes are stable, which generally is uh, when you are an adult. And so uh, women, their eyes tend to stabilize a little bit sooner, so maybe the 18 to 20 range. And then for men, um, in the early 20s, the vision should stabilize. And then at that point, you can transition into normal, regular contacts. Uh, but for you know, the rest of your, uh, your childhood, you would wear special contacts to slow myopia progression.